Nevada's unemployment rate fell to 6.9% in June, down from 7% in May and 7.8% a year ago. This is the first time in seven years that the state's unemployment rate has registered at a rate lower than 7%. This is the 54th consecutive month of job gains relative to the previous year and the highest employment level that Nevada has experienced since August of 2008 at a seasonally adjusted 1.26 million. Dozens of people, many directly impacted by deportation orders, were at the Grant Sawyer government building to deliver petitions and a message to Nevada Attorney General Adam Laxalt. The petition, with about 48,000 signatures, was placed inside a plastic child wagon and children delivered the signatures to Laxalt's Las Vegas office. One by one, children spoke to the receptionist as piles of petitions were handed over. The children are part of several deportation cases that could split their families. Nevada is part of a lawsuit that is trying to stop President Obama's executive order that would protect some child immigrants and their parents. The children and families in attendance at the government building said they want Laxalt to remove Nevada from the lawsuit. Laxalt has declined. As part of its ongoing commitment to improving the health and management of wild horses and burrows on federal lands in the West, the Bureau of Land Management said it will initiate 21 research projects aimed at developing new tools for managing healthy horses and burrows on healthy rangelands, including safe and effective ways to slow the population growth rate of the animals and reduce the need to remove animals from public lands. With virtually no natural predators, wild horse herds can double in size about every four years. Overpopulation on the range, in addition to prolonged drought conditions, can lead to deterioration of the land and the animal's health. Over the past 40 years, the BLM has adopted out more than 230,000 horses and burros that were removed from the range to protect animal and land health. Today, adoption rates are at a record low. In the early 2000s, the BLM was able to adopt out nearly 8,000 horses each year. Over the last few years, animal adoption totals have been closer to 2,500 animals per year. The total lifetime cost for caring for an unadopted animal is nearly $50,000. I'm Deanne O'Donnell. That's your news across Nevada.